Morning grade threes. I hope you had a really good day yesterday in your specialist classes um, or doing your specialist classes and I hope you managed to get along to Miss Ferrari's Zoom lesson where she um, I think did some very active activities with you so hopefully you had a bit of fun doing that. So today guys with our writing every writing session on Friday will be related to our POS Ed focus and it will be related to this week will be related to humor so I've got um, I have the link for this video here and then I've got a funny video you might think it's funny maybe you won't you have to have a look at that let your parents know that yes it is a bit of a silly video but you're not just playing on you you know not just looking at YouTube videos and doing silly stuff um, so like last week we're going to do a bit of writing where you first explain what you think the character's strength is, what it means to you, and then you're going to write a little story about something or a time that um, that you use that character's strength for, something that relates to that character's strength. So I've got two um, videos, uh, two photos here I should say. The first one that I want you to look at is this one, and I'm going to read it to you. So I want you to set your page up like this, humour. Alright, so I started by, I did the heading, Made sure it was nice and colourful. Draw a little smiley, happy face there, because humour is about happiness. And then I wrote quickly what I felt, a short little couple of sentences about what I felt uh, humour is. So humour to me is about what people think is funny. Different people find different things funny. And then I go into my story. My grandpa was a prankster. He also had false teeth. That's not a good combination. When my mum was young, my grandpa would slowly, ever so quietly, sneak behind her, take his false teeth out of his mouth, and put them on her head. Mum, as you can imagine, hated this. My grandpa thought it was absolutely hilarious. One day, my grandpa tried his trick on mum, and she flicked his false teeth off his head and accidentally stood on them, shattering them. My grandpa had to eat out of a straw for a week. He didn't have any teeth. Now who's laughing? So I'm trying to think of a, a funny sort of story that had happened uh, that I'd heard. And that was a story that mum used to tell a bit and it was always really funny. Eventually my grandpa had some false teeth put in that couldn't come out because he used to do it all the time, and I think it was a bit better for him not, not to have his teeth coming out all the time. But I also use that story because it shows like how humour is different for different people. My grandpa loved doing that prank on my mum, but my mum really didn't like it, except she got her own back. And I think she thought it was always pretty funny that she got her own back. So humour is, you know, one of those things that it's great telling a joke, isn't it? But not everyone gets your jokes all the time. Sometimes some people think it's funny and some people don't think it's funny. All right, and there's all different types of humour going on out there. What's interesting is that I'm just sort of looking outside because there's a lot of rain. What is interesting is that humour, like with comics, people that are really funny people, like comics, comedians. Some people like different types of comedians as well because people have different types of humour, and in different countries there are different types of humour. It's amazing, isn't it? Really. All right, I'm looking forward to hearing some of these stories. If you want to post them, that would be fantastic. Make sure you like this post as well, guys, and enjoy your Friday. Have a great weekend, and I'll see you uh, online on Monday.